Um, right now you're seeing me in this box again because yesterday was awesome. Now, I'm going to try to make this brief and, and kind of get everything in, but if it doesn't, it's going to continue over to part two. So, yesterday, yesterday was like the biggest day of my life, and it was amazing. I'm going to explain that later. So, yesterday, I went to the Westport uh, Toward an Ed Fighting Gathering. So, I'm going to just ramble, so that's okay. I hope you're okay with that. Then I'm going to use a lot of the hand gesturing thing, because I like hand gesturing. So, I got up kind of late, because I tossed and turned the, the night before, and then I finally, somewhere around 3 o'clock in the morning, finally passed out, and then woke up at like 11. I was like freaking out, because I'm like, oh my god, it's 11 o'clock, I don't have enough time! I wasn't leaving until like 4. It just shows you how much of a girly girl I am. It takes me that long to get ready. Yes, yes it does. Plus I still had to pack a few things, get cameras all set and whatnot. Books, make sure everything was where it needed to be so I could get it signed and stuff. So, finally, I was ready, ready to go. At about 3.30, 3.30, 45-ish-ish. So we left, we had to go, like, run a few errands before we actually, like, started on our way down to Westport. And it was, like, probably about a little bit before 4-ish when we actually started down to Westport. Um, we had to stop at the bank and whatnot and get money and stuff, so money is important, especially if you want to buy Hank CD, which is really awesome, but I'll, again, get to that later. Um, so basically we started down at, like, a little bit before 4-ish, and we got there. It was supposed to take like an hour and a half to like, an hour 15 minutes to an hour and a half. And it took us like an hour. Like, it was insane. So, we got there like wicked early. I'm thinking it's like, gonna be all like, traffic-y and whatnot. And it wasn't. It was awesome. We got there and there was a little bit of traffic hitting Bridgeport, but after that, it was like, smooth sailing from there. Everyone was freaking out because we thought it was gonna be a really crappy drive, because the road that we had to go on is really, really, really bad. But that's okay. We got there, and it was awesome, and the drive was fine, and there was no, pretty much no stress, which is really fantastic. So, we got there, and it was like, mmm, five-ish, what is it, teeny little bit after five-ish? Um, and, lo and behold, there was a woman there, and we talked to her, and we were trying to find out a little bit of the dirt, you know, see what was going on, see if John and Hank were there yet, or if they were getting there, what time they were going to be there. Turns out, talking to people is awesome. Seriously? Okay, so, I, I digress. Um, talking to people, if you get to a gathering and there's someone you can talk to, talk to them because it might pay off later. I'll explain that in a minute. So, it's probably about um, six-ish at this point, and the room stops. The entire room stops. And the fangirl screen starts. Everyone just turns, like you see them all, turn all in one direction, all at once. Like it was, <laughs> it was ridiculous. But that was right when John and Hank walked to the door. And I'll admit this, and John and Hank, if you're watching this, which you're probably not going to be, but if you are, yeah, I fangirled you a little bit. Okay, I'll admit that. I totally squeed when they came in. I was like, oh my god, it's John and Hank! And I was like, I just saw Catherine off. I'm like, oh my god, it's Catherine! <laughs> yeah, I, I had my fangirl moment. That was like my only fangirl moment of the night, pretty much. Pretty much, I guess. I'd like to emphasize the pretty much part. Um, so they came in, and there's a picture, which you'll see. I'll link you in the um, 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 sidebar over there to my album of pictures, which I eventually will be making into a collage. Eventually. Um, if you look in my channel, I don't know if you're, if you're on the page of my channel right now, you can look down, and there's a bunch of videos down there you can watch about the actual event itself. Um, so they, they came in, they started setting up, Catherine started setting up like the t-shirt CD booth, the lady was setting up the, the book booth, there was another lady setting up something other booth, something or other, I don't know. So, 
So they were getting stuff, and my mom, the lovely, my amazing mom that she is, goes over and talks to Catherine. And she's talking to Catherine, and I'm all like, my mom's talking to Catherine. Holy crap, my mom's talking to Catherine! <laughs> of course, my mom has no idea who the Catherine is. He's just like, oh, it's a person, let's go talk to them. They're selling stuff. <laughs> I love my mom, she's so awesome. Um, anyways, <laughs> so she goes over and talks to her, and she comes back a couple minutes later. She's like, she kind of gives me the dirt on what's going on with the CD sale and stuff. So at this point, um, I, I was talking to nerd fighters and whatnot and staring at the Catherine and fangirling a little bit over the Catherine. Okay, a lot. I don't know, Catherine, you're probably not watching this either, but you really are awesome. I'll get to more of your awesome in a minute. So at this point, it's probably 6.30ish. So a lady comes over to us. This is the lady that I originally talked to, mind you. This is where talking to people that you see and think may be in charge comes in handy. Lady comes over and goes, Oh yeah, we're going to take a couple of you, you know, to get your book signed early by John. My mouth drops, What? Get books signed early by John? Really? So she picks out a couple of people that were there with me at 5 o'clock. There was about 10 of you-ish. So me and like, and my mom and like, I don't know, six other girls maybe-ish. Maybe it wasn't ten. Maybe it, it looked like ten of us were there. She didn't take all the people that were there originally. She didn't. And if she's watching this, she should know that. Those two other girls that were there should have been able to go up too. Anyway, so I was one of the people that got to go up early and get John to send my books early. It was so freaking cool. It was all because my mom talked to the lady when we got in the door. Oh my god, my mom's awesome. That's another reason my mom's awesome, and you'll get more of those in a minute. So, I go up to John, and I start rambling, because I'm going to show you a picture, I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Uh, I was telling a story about this picture, and how I found it on, uh, not how I found it, but how my, my friend that I've been talking to, Amber, if you're watching this, I'm plugging you. She's the Amber one on um, YouTube, so go find her, she's awesome. She found this picture on Facebook. And someone posted it to John's profile, or John or Hank's, or both, maybe, I think, actually. I don't remember which gathering it was from. I don't remember who posted it. But if you if you took this picture and you have it, you're awesome. We printed out your picture, and we had them sign it, right? Here, and right here. That's Jay Scribble right there. So basically... That was pretty awesome, and I told him the story about how I was getting the picture signed for a girl in California who couldn't be there because she was in California, clearly. And he was like, that's so awesome of you, you're so nice, that's so cool. I'm like, pwned! <laughs> I was so excited, and I started to I don't even remember what the rest of the stuff that I said was, but that was definitely one of them. That was the only thing I remember is the picture. That's the only thing I remember telling John is about the picture. So then... We go back to the line because we can't technically go into the auditorium yet because we're doing sound check. Um, so we go back in the line and I start talking to more nerd fighters again, which is really awesome. I don't know who you are, but you were like, one of you came in from New York and one of you was from a college in Connecticut somewhere. If you remember my face or my name or anything, uh, you probably won't be watching my YouTube channel because I don't think we talked about YouTube, but... If you do, by some chance, come across my YouTube channel, hi! You were really awesome to meet. I loved talking to you for the, like, ten minutes that I was talking to you for. Then, like, at, like, almost exactly seven o'clock, they let us into the auditorium. So at this point, I only met John. So, we go into the auditorium, and we're talking, and talking with my mom, talking with blah, 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 and the lady goes on stage, and she does a little introduction thingy, because people clearly don't know who John is if they're at this event. Clearly. Maybe the parents of the nerd fighters, which, there really weren't that many nerd fighter parents there, to be honest. But that's, again, beside the point. They do the thing, they ask, they do the question Tuesday, Hank sings some songs, John talks about his book a little more. And it was awesome, and then it was over. So, this is now, um, quarter after eight, I want to say. And we all 